Psalm 119, verses 129 through 136. Have you ever faced the problem of dullness and darkness and dryness? Oh, we've all been through it. There are certain days that come to us when it's just dull. I don't mean the weather is dull. That's a possibility. But life is just dull. There's a sameness and a tameness about it. Or sometimes we have to go through darkness. We're wondering, what in the world is God doing? The valley is so dark. Or dryness. Down inside, we are just so dry and so hungry and so thirsty. What is the answer? The answer is the Word of God. Listen to Psalm 119. Verse 129, Thy testimonies are wonderful, therefore doth my soul keep them. Now this takes care of the problem of dullness. Life cannot be dull when you are reading and obeying the wonderful Word of God. The Word of God has a way of taking the ordinary things of life and just making them wonderful. When your mind and heart are filled with the Word of God, Everything you see becomes wonderful. That takes care of the dullness of life. How about the darkness of life? Psalm 119, verse 130. The entrance of thy words giveth light, it giveth understanding unto the simple. That word entrance means the opening up, the expounding, the unfolding. As the word of God is unfolded to us, it gives us light. Oh, if you find yourself in the darkness today, just open your Bible and God's Word will give you light. How about this matter of dryness? Oh, there are days when I feel so dry and so needy. Psalm 119, verse 131. I opened my mouth and panted, for I longed for thy commandments. The Word of God satisfies us. The Word of God is like breath when you feel smothered. The Word of God is like water when you are so thirsty down inside. The Word of God is food that nourishes and satisfies. I don't know what kind of a day you're going to have today. If it's a dull day, turn to the Word of God. If it's a dark day, turn to the Word of God. If it's a dry day down inside, turn to the Word of God. His testimonies are wonderful. They bring light and they satisfy the longing of your heart.